Growing up as boys and girls. Introduction. What is identity? Identity is the persona of the individual created by her or his own characteristics, physical, mental and emotional. Gender indicates the various social values and stereotypes that our culture attach to the biological distinction male and female. This makes us think that the roles we see men and women around us play are fixed and natural. It also helps us to understand how and why inequalities and unfair power relations between men and women exist in society. Boys and girls in societies grow up differently. Very early on in life, there are clear distinctions made between the two. While being a boy or a girl is important to our identity, most of us think that our identity is created by our gender alone and there is no scope for role reversal. However, this is not true. In 1960s in Samoa Islands, for example, boys till the age of 9 help their sisters to look after younger siblings at home. Thereafter, they would go out to join the older boys for fishing or planting coconuts. But the girls would continue to stay at home and look after the young ones. They would cook and wash and clean the households too. These were specific tasks for specific genders. However, after the age of 14, the girls would join in the outdoor jobs and learn to weave baskets do fishing, etc. Cooking would be done in special preparation houses, mainly by the boys and the girls would help in the preparations. Thus, roles were reversed. Consider, for example, in a semi-urban city in India, at an early age, when deep impressions can be formed, they are given distinct kinds of toys to play with. By the evenings, boys can be seen playing on the streets while girls can be seen coming back from school. Streets are crowded. Girls hurry back to their homes in groups as they are afraid of getting teased or attacked.